So a little while ago, I filmed a defense video for the triangle, basically triangle escape. And a lot of people were saying that it left me exposed for the armbar, which yes, uh, in fact, it does leave me exposed for the armbar, but basically going from a completely locked in triangle to now defending an armbar where they have both legs over the head when I'm on top is a much, much easier situation to deal with. And so I wanna show the escape for that arm lock when they transition to it. It's such a simple escape, it's so easy. Um, and so let's go over it. Okay. So we're gonna be here. So once he locks this triangle up, right, go ahead and lock it up. Yeah. Immediately what I wanna do is I wanna to start to stack him on his neck. And just this pressure on his neck makes his legs break. So a lot of times what will happen is, as I'm stacking him and my arm is here, he's gonna switch to this triangle, okay? So yes, my arm is extended here, but even with his legs locked in, as soon as he starts to try to stretch me away, if I put my belly forward and my head back, his legs pop right off my head. Go ahead and finish that arm bar. Okay. Once he loses my head, he completely loses the arm bar. And it's a simple, simple, defense of just putting my belly in. So we're here, basically from this situation, with the arm, with the triangle, I'm gonna tap. If I don't get out of this triangle, I'm gonna tap. So go ahead and lock it in. And pull my head down, and finish, go. So his legs broke. I'm out of the triangle now. Can you finish the triangle? No. So he's gonna switch to the arm bar. Go. Once he switches to the arm bar, I start to drive forward with my belly. And so it allows me to pass his guard. I automatically end up with the guard pass. So we'll do it from another angle just so you guys can see. I'm gonna lay down here. So in here, lock up your triangle, lock it up, no squeeze. Once I put him over his neck, everything breaks. Now when he switches, so you can see he's locking tight on my head, he's got my arm, but from here, once my belly goes in, he completely loses it. One more time. Lock everything in. No, lock it, lock it tighter. Tighter? Yes. Hold it. So already things are starting to break. Now he goes switches to the arm bar. So immediately when he switches to the arm bar, mm -hmm. belly in. So my belly in goes in, my head goes back, really pushing forward with my chest and belly, and that frees the legs from the head. So that's a super simple defense. And um, when it comes to risk versus reward, I'd much rather have to defend that arm bar than try to defend a locked in triangle or try to stay in a locked in triangle. So uh, it's worth it for me to use that escape because the secondary escape, the second escape is, is much, much easier.